This is the Fox 11 Morning News. 616 right now. A new prescription diet drug called Qsimiyup has just received FDA approval. Dr. Adrian Udeem of the Weight Loss Center at Cedar sinai is here to explain the benefits and the risks. Dr. Udeem, thanks so much for joining us this morning. This is the second drug, Belvique being the first drug. This one saw more dramatic results, is that right? That's correct. Uh, this is a drug that is a combination of two medications that are currently already available on the market. The first is Phentermine, which is a drug that is already approved for weight loss. It's an appetite suppressant. The second drug is topiramate, which is a drug that is approved for seizures and for migraine headaches and has the side effect of weight loss. These two drugs together uh, have been shown to induce about 10% weight loss in individuals at one year. All right, so now, Dr. Udeem, if, if I'm 5, 10 pounds overweight, this is not something I necessarily need to take. Well, it has been shown to work with diet and exercise as an adjunct to help people induce that degree of weight loss. And that 5 to 10 percent, which can translate into about 10 pounds in a 200 pound individual, is enough to demonstrate benefits in medical diseases associated with obesity. So, All right, but, but, but there are concerns. We're talking about uh, the risk of perhaps increased heart rate, also concerns uh, raised about the increased risk of birth defects. So how should people then weigh the benefits versus the risks? Absolutely, so any medication does have side effects, and in this case, you're right. Uh, the two main ones are increased heart rate and the chance of birth defects in patients who are in people who are um, pregnant or are interested in pregnancy. It really is a responsible decision between the physician and the individual to weigh the risks and to use it responsibly. In women of childbearing age, they should be on birth control, they should be tested routinely for pregnancy. However, given those risks and in the appropriate individual, it is a good adjunct to diet and exercise. And also there is apparently some concern about something called metabolic acidosis. Can you explain exactly what that is and why we are concerned about that? Right, so uh, this is a uh, acid-base abnormality in the uh, body that can be induced with certain drugs. It is something that can be detected with routine blood tests. And again, any individual who is on this medication should be under the direction of a physician, should be seen routinely to get blood tests as well as vitals, which would detect the elevations in heart rate that you have discussed. So, so it is a drug that should be uh, taken under the direction of a, of a, a uh, physician. And as you pointed out, Dr. Udeen, there are benefits such as lower cholesterol, lower blood pressure, and of course, the obvious weight loss. Dr. Udeen, thanks so much for joining us this morning. Really appreciate it. Yeah, Thanks it is a prescription me. drug too. Hey, talk about getting healthier. Maybe it has something to do with where you live.